Tommy, daj ju... Tommy, 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 Tommy. Fed, Fed, never forget Felipe. Hey. Filippo, yeah. welcome back. Absolute pleasure to have you back at Vicarage Road. Yeah, thank you very much for me. It's a great pleasure to be to be here. It's unbelievable the, the atmosphere. And okay, 20 years has passed, but uh, it was like uh, it was a great experience to me. To come here. You was only here one season, but how special was how special was your time here? Uh, it was special because uh, my one of my dream was to come to England and play in English football. And even if uh, at that time I was uh, 38, it was like a, a, a dream come true. And uh, to come here in Watford, where the atmosphere is, uh, is, is I think is different. is uh, is really an unbelievable was something that I, I will remember forever. Um, place has changed so much. Yes, it's unbelievable the way the, the stadium has, has changed, but I think uh, it's due to the fact that uh, football is, uh, is growing, and I think the, the, the Pozzo family invested a lot of, of money in, uh, in football and in the club as Watford, because uh, they, they, they realized the, the, the potential of this, uh, of this club. So much has changed because of the Pozzo family. How well do you know them? How long do you go back with them? Uh, well, uh, Pozzo is uh, Udinese in, uh, in Italy. and uh, We played many times against uh, when I was at uh, Milan. Uh, Pozzo, uh, Pozzo also owns uh, clubs in, uh, in, uh, in Italy and uh, in Spain. I'm not sure that it's still a, a club in Spain, but uh, is a very important entrepreneur. Did they ever try to sign you, the Pozzos? <laughs> no, 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 never, never, never. I spent all my career in, uh, in, uh, in AC Milan, almost my career in, uh, almost all my career in, in AC Milan for 14 seasons. Then I moved to Reggiana, Brescia, but I never had the chance to, to, to score, to sh sign with, uh, with Pozzo, with uh, Udinese. You won five Serie A titles. Three Champions League titles. Mm. What made you sign for Watford? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, uh, well, of course, the fact that I had that I had that dream to play in England, and then the fact that uh, by chance I received a call from uh, 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 a man who who at, who at that time was working for Viali, and they were asking, they were looking for a centre forward, so they asked me about uh, about Tare, who was the centre forward of uh, Brescia, the, 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 the club where, where I was playing for, and uh, and then at the end of the of the of the call, uh, this man told me, okay, we are also going, we are also need to uh, a centre for a centre defender, and uh, I said just uh, just uh, like like. Uh, I told I told him okay I could come over because Bre I didn't sign with Brescia. Then I moved to to Australia for uh, for vacation, and Viali called me up and in a, in a while we reached the, the agreement and it was uh, as I told you before uh, a dream come true. You went from playing with Paolo Maldini mm -hmm. to Paul Robinson. Yeah, <laughs> for your friend, yes. your brother. Sorry, uh, Robinson was a work hard player and uh, it was uh, really important to me uh, find, to, f to find some players like him here at Warford so that allow me to, 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 settle, to settle down and, and I hope I try to, to do my best. Uh, unfortunately I got injured uh, and so I miss uh, many games uh, at the end of the season 
uh, and unfortunately it was a quite disappointing season at that time. But uh, the people, the supporters of uh, Watford were always close to the, to, to the team. You've played at some of the biggest stadiums in the world, mm -hmm. but all of a sudden you're playing at Grimsby and you're Grimsby, playing at Stockport. Grimsby, Stockport, yeah. Was it a Stock, big shock? Stockport where, where, I got, where I got injured. But well, uh, when, at the beginning of my career, I also played in Serie C, in third division in Italy, uh, when I, I moved to Pescara on loan from AC Milan. And then the end of my of my career, when I was back from uh, Watford, I played in the, in the fourth division in Italy. So I think when you put uh, your heart, uh, it is not important the the, the league. And uh, Watford for me was was for me that. Uh, to do, to try to do my best and to give my best, and I hope uh, I have given something to this club. Even as I told you, that the, the season was not so good. What do you remember of your teammates then? Oh, teammates, uh, one crazy. Okay, Paul Robinson, uh, Mika Aida, uh, Ramon Vega, uh, uh, Nielsen, uh, uh, Coxie. Chamberlain, the, 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 the goalkeeper, many players, Elguson, and uh, okay, also Ray Wilkins that was with us uh, as an assistant coach, and many other players, uh, uh, Patrick Blondeau, another crazy. <laughs> you smile so much at your time here when you're talking about these players. It was yeah, a special it, time? It was a special time. It was really a special time, and I really enjoy it. The only uh, regret is that uh, we didn't win anything. We didn't. We didn't uh, make the the promotion. Just talk to me about the goal against Walsall. Was it? Oh, at that well, end? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I remember. It was, it was an header. Only one, unfortunately. But uh, sometimes I go and see it <laughs> because I didn't score many, many, many goals in my in my career my career so sometimes I like to go and watch uh, the video. <laughs> What's interesting I don't know whether you know in Watford's squad is Domingos Kina. His father Samuel played for Benfica in the 1990 the 19... European Cup final. Ah well ah that's strange. Crazy, yeah huh? yeah it's crazy yeah yes yeah, the world is strange. <laughs> um, how pleased are you to be back then and, and how much are you looking forward to the game? Well, now uh, Watford is struggling, uh, but the, the last three games uh, it, uh, we did very well. So to one draw and to win, so hopefully uh, it's going to be a, a win today. It's not easy because uh, I know that Wolves is a good side. They are very good up front, uh, so we will see. Of course, I, I support and sustain uh, uh, Watford today. Great. Thank you so much. It's been an absolute Thank pleasure you. Thank you, you very Thank much. You. Thank Enjoy you very much, everybody. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks. Click here for more videos.